mali ya wanaeji atuwezi kubali ya hibiwe, ifunjwe, wenye watapanya yu makosa au wanafunja kiaria watastakiwa, the president has been very clear, the entire government is very clear that we are not going to accept anybody, anywhere, to damage the property of a citizen in this country. Mali ya uma, mali ya binadamu bora inji, even protected na security forces, wameambiwa family that it has to be done. Mwenye atafunja sheria, atakutana na sheria. I want to ask the opposition leader, Raila Odinga, with his age as a grandfather, his age of my grandfather, I want to encourage him that he needs to show an example to the youthful generation in this country. And the time has come for our youth to understand better. They should not be used in illegal activities such as what we saw in Nairobi and other parts of this country. I want him to ask the opposition leader, Raila Odinga, that as he approaches the eight wee hours as an elder grandfather, he should make peace with this nation and his children. He should not participate in, in this, uh, he should not participate in illegal activities such as demonstrations and picketing and destruction of property. I want to tell Raila that Raila picketing and finalizing expressway and destroying property will not bring the cost of living down. And I want to tell Raila, you are behaving like that woman who gave birth to a baby and sat on the baby and claimed the baby of the other woman. Raila, I want to tell you, we are not cutting this government into two. This government has its honor and kindly give us space. There is nowhere in the constitution or the laws of Kenya, where it says when you get 10 million signatures, you can get a president out of his Bongo. Therefore, be genuine in Kenya. Don't take young people to the streets. Now, at the wako we nyewe, mungina ako wakalonza ako yala, wako raila ako yala, lakini wana inji unataku wapeleka pale kwa street, unaendelea kumwaga damu ya vijana. I want to encourage young people in this country. Please, don't go to the streets. Lakini ni aibu sana. Wakati raizu wetu William Samoe Ruta anafanya kazi kenya hii. Ametembea ulumwevu mzima kutafuta investors wa kuti kenya hii. Ili uchumi improve katika kenya yetu. Uporaji wa mali ya wanaichi na wanabiyashara. Tumeona vifo, tumeshuria vifo ambaye mefanyika kufuatia maandamano ambaye ya meitwa na kiongozi wa upinzani Raila Udinga. Na sisi tumesama kwamba hayo maandamano sio maandamano ya kawaida. Haya maandamano imekuwa hatari ya usalama wa taifa letu la Kenya.